Nina Dobra is a beautiful woman and to make out with her should in theory be a pleasure you know no matter who you're married to or what, what your codes are or your, or your you know uh, I, I, the problem is is that when you go and do this stuff and it sounds like I'm just saying it but it's so by the numbers and nothing could be more of a, 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 a of an erection killer than um, than cameras around you and kind of you know that's that's that was a terrible <laughs> why did I I'm, uh, it's like honestly man it's uh, and this is going to sound so uh, so actory but it's like dance steps it's literally like choreographing a fight you're going to grab me here I'm going to kiss you here you're going to drop there we're going to go to the pillows you're going to pull my shirt off of this it's like it's like dance steps it's not it's and then you know you'll be in the middle and they'll be like oh just just tilt your chin up because the light's not hitting quite any greatly like it's the it's the opposite of of sexy that, that, that these romantic scenes I kind of enjoy the interplay of kind of like wooing someone or things like that because that that, that that can be that, that can be a real energy that you can tap into but as for the physical act of making out it's not that fun I, I like them both you know I I, I, I I like to just I like to be able to successfully do a scene you know like I I never I mean in my entire body of work I think I'm pleased with about two scenes that I've ever done you know so and, and, and it's kind of what I love about um, being an actor I think that if if you're you, you're always you're always trying to, to, to do a wonderful scene, you know. So I, I, if I do anything well, I'm just pleased, you know, because I, I mostly think of my career as just a series of fuck ups. You know, you end up doing a lot of writing as an actor anyway. You just do, like you know, I, I could deny this, but you, but you, you do because. After a time, you get to know the character, and it's kind of yours and belongs to you. There might be a certain cadence or, uh, you know, uh, specificities of speech or things that you wouldn't say sometimes because you're like, I don't need to say that because in the last episode I did this. Or, and nobody becomes a better master of your character than you do. And I always think that, not always, because because so often actors will have terrible ideas for for lines, you know. But but often they have really good. Often they're a really good consultant on on what what to say now to, to sort of splinter off and answer your question more specifically when you're writing for the purposes of just writing like you when, I, when I'm writing my own I'm writing my next film for example right now it's excruciating it's excruciating it's the most it's the most difficult it's to, to write to, to write anybody can write anybody can write a screenplay anybody anybody can write a TV I mean I'm gonna say it anybody can write a TV show but to write a good TV show that, that's a slim percentage. You write a great movie, that's almost no one. You know that. You, you, so the, the 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 ravine between you and, and a good piece of work is like to, to span that. It can take years sometimes. I find writing, I find writing, writing absolutely brutal and um, and one of the most difficult parts of the process of the process of creation.